What's up everybody? Chris with South Carolina Gun School and today we're going to be unboxing the core essential belt that I just got. Welcome back everybody. Like I talked about, we're gonna be unboxing the core essential, um, I guess you'd say everyday carry belt, uh, but they've got some really, really great belts. If you don't know about core essential, I feel sorry for you. Here's your chance to learn a little bit about them. This is a, they, they make some really, really good quality belts. It's just phenomenal how stiff they are. Uh, what I tell everybody when you're looking for an everyday carry belt is you need to find something that is very, very sturdy. So what I'm talking about is, so let's use this knife for an example. This is your belt. If you can take your belt and put it in your hand like this and squeeze and fold it in half, that is not a belt that you need for everyday carry. You need a good, good, sturdy belt. There's a lot of great companies out there. I liked Core the best. Uh, so let's go ahead and take a look here. Of course, there's our receipt. What's this? So this talks about, okay, so it talks about how to uh, size your belt. Uh, another good thing about this is you have what they call tactical belts and then you have what they call um, EBC belts. So as you can see here's the belt. Another reason I like this company is these belts are geared for skinny. So if you're a skinny mini or if you're a fat ass like me which won't be much longer. I'm working on getting some of that off, but another reason I went with this belt because let's get it out of this plastic here. As you can see, I've got what they would call their tactical belt, I presume. So you have, I'm about to lose this plastic. I don't feel like chasing it down. Uh, you have these little, I don't know if you can see them, but these little locking mechanisms in here just like, um, almost like your zip ties. Uh, here is the buckle that it comes with. Again, as you can see, I've got the nylon tactical belt. I guess you'd say they make it in a leather. So if you wanna have something nice uh, to wear, if you've gotta kinda be a little more uh, professional with your dress attire. Uh, they come with also different belt clips so you can switch them out and change them out if you want to have something that looks a little bit more professional. But if you can see this little notch right here, you push that and that's what will, if you can listen right here, I don't know if you can hear it. It doesn't really, but you see, it'll click in if you want to take it off. Just push that down and it slides right out. But I don't know if you can see it. I can feel it locking in. But you see, once it locks in, it's in there. And then push it down, take it out, adjust it, whatever you need to do. If you can look here on this side, so it'll tell you, it'll tell you 24 all the way up to 54 and you've got little notches on the inside. I know it might be hard to see. I shouldn't say notches. You've got lines here on where you're going to cut your belt depending on your waist size. And if you can look, you can see how sturdy this thing is made. Um, I'm not cutting this thing up just yet. 
well, I shouldn't say that. I'm going to cut, but I'm not going to cut it open. Uh, some other people have had this um, pretty much passed to them by court for them to do reviews. This uh, I paid for with my own money. Core didn't send me this. They're not sponsoring me. Although, hey, Core, here you go. I wouldn't mind uh, a couple more belts if you want me to do some reviews on them. I just wanted to do a quick little unboxing. Uh, I've still got to put everything together. So your belt, belt clip, see that just lifts up right there. And then you slide it on once you've got it cut to where you want to slide that on. And then you lock it in and it's got some screws in here where you screw it in and it holds everything down. But as you can see, so what I was talking about is you want to, when you're looking for a belt, take your belt like this, put it in your hand. Put it in your hand just like this right here and squeeze it. So you can see this thing, if this thing folds in half, so if my belt's like this and I can fold it in half like that, you do not need that belt for an everyday carry. You need a good sturdy belt. I love what Core Essentials is doing. I've been a big fan of them since I found out about them. And I finally went in and took my slack ass and finally bought me one. I've just got to get it all put together. I wanted to do a quick little intro video letting everybody know about it. So in case any one of you want to uh, go out there and check them out and get one of their belts, here you go. Uh, I'm going to get it set up, start wearing it, and I'm going to give it maybe a month or two. And then I'll come back in and do another little review video talking about it, how it's working, how it's holding up, uh, what kind of guns I have been carrying with it and how it feels and everything. But I want to say this is the, I got the inch and a half. They got them an inch and a half and in an inch and three quarter. So according to this, uh, leather belts hold up to four pounds. Tactical belts that I got hold up to eight pounds. So it looks like I can put some more gear on this than just, just a gun. So there you go. So leather belts won't hold as much, but if you want to look a little bit more professional, you do have that option. But yeah, I'll do, like I said, probably, I would say a month or two from now, I'll come back and do a little update video to let you know how it's holding up and everything. But again, Core Essentials, I'll have a link, excuse me, a link down in the description so you can go in and check them out. Price point was, Seventy something, sixty. Now this just tells me what it was. It's not crazy about what you're gonna pay for any good, um, good everyday carry belt. Yeah, it doesn't have the price point on here. Sixty, seventy bucks somewhere in there. Um, I want to say you can get a package deal where you get the tactical belt and the leather belt all in one package for one 110 to 120 somewhere there again all, all that's in the de, in the description i'll have that link down in the description so you can go in and check it out and look at the price point but from what i looked at at all the other belts that's about what you're going to pay somewhere between i would say 60 to 100 dollars just for one belt for good everyday carry belt the good thing about the tactical belt from what i'm reading eight pounds so you can throw some gear on and you can actually use it in a training class if you wanted to use this in a training class and not put a big tactical i should say battle belt more um, there are different variations i have another tactical belt from safe life i've done a review on it's two inches thick got molly attachments you got the inner belt outer belt where this is just one belt alone but go in check it out and I will update y'all in about a month or two on how it's wearing and how it's holding up. And always remember, folks, if you're not shooting, you're reloading. If you're not reloading, you're fighting. If you're not fighting, you're dead. Train to live. See you on the range.